one of the particular highlights this time was the fact that we had the mandate to look at four new studies that were published on titanium dioxide following the adoption of the uh, opinion by the panel. In fact, we were lucky in, in two senses. First of all, we could do, uh, we could discuss those four um, uh, studies in an open plenary, which is a demonstration that open EFSA is real. We are really transparent, uh, we have nothing to hide. The second thing is that we had uh, also the opportunity to interview four authors from among the authors of the four uh, studies, and they were kind enough to be here. They provided us with details. We could uh, pose questions, detailed questions. What we will be doing is, of course, we will provide a, an opinion reflecting the impact of these studies on the assessment that we have conducted, and then we will certainly be following the literature. But what it shows is also that we are not afraid to look at new data, and we're open to look at them any time they appear. So nothing is done be behind closed doors, and nothing is done that does not uh, take into account any new data that appear. That is, for me, really a big, big highlight of this, uh, of, of this uh, panel meeting. In fact, we uh, adopted uh, a number of opinions. But one particular opinion that was uh, really very important is the guidance on nutrient sources, which will be of use because we are actually, uh, we will not be dealing with nutrient sources as of the new mandate in July. It will be handed over to the uh, NDA panel, but we are sure now that the same principles will be followed and that is also transparent and clear to the outside world what we are going to do with the data that they provide in order to assess uh, nutrient sources. So it's, uh, for me it's also another highlight. We had on site around 10 observers and we had 70 following us online, which is actually uh, a good sign that the work that we are doing is of interest and it also reflects that the efforts of EFSA to be open and transparent are also gratified by an interest in the public and in those in interested parties. So uh, we were really very happy to see that it is really uh, confirmed once again.